guys, what is up? This is Raz, and I am doing a quick follow-up of the pipe bomb that I kind of cut on YouTube. <clears throat> oh, my bad, my bad. I'm just talking like some of these YouTubers that have so many more subs. I mean, like, how do they get so many subs? These guys literally have no personality. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> and me, like, I try to have some personality. I mean, I... I understand my potty mouth might get me in trouble sometimes, but I mean, I mean, come on now. I mean, come on. Like, damn, my uh, fucking, uh, <laughs> like, I'm thinking of all these female YouTubers. Sniper Wolf. I mean, like, I understand a lot of people like her. How the fuck does she get all these? Stuff? She literally just sits there and watches a video, and, and, like, you can. You can clearly see what's happening in the video or the photo, and she explains it. Why the fuck? Do you, th this is literally like the least effort I've ever seen into a video. Like the only thing she does is ed edit the video, but like the actual content she when she's making it and recording it, it what? <laughs> like at least reaction time in Azzy Land, like, I, and I do like reaction time. Uh, Azzy Land, I, I feel like she's a little bit of one of those YouTube thoughts, but like, you know, like that music video. But I mean, I'll give her credit. She knows what 12 year old guys are going to like in the music video. They want to see the cakes and, you know, the, um, uh, I'm trying to think of a subtle word for breasts, but, you know, I mean, I, I can't really think of one. They obviously want to see the cakes. I mean, I'm all about the cakes, but I mean, come on, Azzy. Like, you can be so much better than just selling your body for a fucking music video. I mean, reaction time, like, that's a cool dude. Like, I'd hang out with him and all his buddies, but I mean, I don't think he does in a lot of videos in reaction time anymore. They're pushing free time more, which I don't have a problem with. Those are entertaining as hell. But, I mean, like, I'm thinking of some of these guys that have, like, millions, like, the top ten channels. Most of the time, those people don't, have, like, sure, the top ten videos, just the title itself is going to get you inter interested, like, whatever list they're doing. But at the same time, the people they get to narrate those literally are, like, the blandest people I've ever seen in my life. Like, I'm going to start doing top ten videos for Pokemon, and you're actually going to hear, like, you know, at least some personality. Like, I mean, come on, bro. Like, you have about as pers um, about as much personality as a cardboard box. Like, like Jeffrey here, for instance. I mean, this motherfucker right here. Like, you have about as much personality as him. I mean, look, I can put the mic up to his mouth and nothing happens because he has no personality I mean this this youngster Joey videos poster right here like it can't talk but it at least it has more it's more colorful and it has more personality than you guys most of the time I mean I, I, I'm not even saying I hate top 10 channels like I watch top 10 channels I'm just saying the people they get to do this and the fact that YouTube's promoting this like I mean you know, it just goes to show, and Shane Dawson, like, I love his conspiracy theory videos, do not get me wrong, but I make the conspiracy theory videos with my own twist, and get, like, no views on them, like, the only one that's been somewhat successful was the Walmart FEMA camp video, and, you know, that's just because, like, I mean, you know, like, I mean, who doesn't want to hear about that, especially coming from an actual Walmart employee, but, I mean, I'm just saying, like, I mean, YouTube, like, you've got to cut your crap. Like, at least give the people, like, these young personalities that maybe we're a little green with the commentary. Yes, because we're inexperienced. Maybe we don't have the equipment that the big YouTubers have or the editing skills. But at least give us a chance. Like, I mean, the only way we're going to grow is by, like, is by Put, like practicing, putting out the content, practicing editing. What well, we're going to be discouraged if we put in all that work for a video that gets like 10, 15 views. Like we're shoot, like I'm shooting for eventually hitting like thousands of views and thousands of subs. I mean, I would love to do this full time, but unfortunately I cannot because I mean, 
YouTube's not giving me the opportunity. And uh, again, streaming kills your channel. At the same time, I'm addicted to streaming on my channel just because I find it to be entertaining with my viewers, especially those karaoke streams. You guys are extremely entertained by that. Like, you you get to watch a 500 pound beached orca whale do karaoke. Like, who doesn't want to see that? So I mean, but I mean, then you have the top 10 videos, number 10 on it. Like, I mean, I actually would was not was able to put some personality in that number 10 on the list the top 10 death scenes from movies number 10 when the Jurassic Park ate when the but, 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 I can't even fucking talk <laughs> that's how you know my I'm shit that's how you know I'm never gonna get big on YouTube but like number 10 on the list when the T-Rex ate the guy who was sitting on the toilet taking a shit. I mean, come on. Like, you could at least say, like, number 10 on the list. When the T-Rex ate the man in the suit taking a shit, it was the funniest fucking thing I've ever seen. Like, I mean, it's not that hard to add any personality into that. And again, I'm not hating on top 10 channels. I'm just saying, like, at least say it with some, like, you're, you enjoy doing it. Is what I'm saying, like, I mean, and again, again, I'm, I'm kind of shooting on YouTube. Push the small content creators, because a lot of us, I feel like, have really good personalities that could translate to YouTube success, like me, Youngster Joey Videos, uh, Pokeblock Trainer Z, in his own way. Like, we all have our personality, but it's in a different way. And, you know, I come across as an asshole, I understand, but, I mean, so do a lot of people. Le Leafy is here got big on YouTube for God's sakes and he was the biggest fucking asshole ever other than like other than fucking Kim Kardashians cause you know <laughs> I'm sorry but <laughs> oh man like I'm gonna have so many people coming after my video Sniper Wolf if you're salty enough to come after my video do it then I'm not afraid of you <laughs> oh man Sniper Wolf put so little effort into her videos that she has time to come after a guy with millions less subscribers than her. Exactly. She's never going to see this, let's be honest. But, I mean, come on. I, I hate to shoot on YouTube like this, but, I mean, come on. Like, we're tired of your crap, YouTube. Like, again, we're tired of your crap. Like, I could have made all these points in the last video, but I didn't. We're tired of your crap. And it, you can see, like, me, like, getting on the mic and cutting stuff like this. Like, obviously, I stumble over my words sometimes. Uh, I'm a little green, but at the same time, I feel like I can keep up the mic work. Like, so, WWE sign me. Vince McMahon, I'm available. Obviously, you won't like me because, I mean, my mic skills are terrible. But, I mean, come on. Hey, what culture? Hire me. I'm just kidding. Yeah, but, like, seriously, like, I mean, I could get more personality out of this shark. I don't know if you can actually see the shark. There's the shark. I can get more personality out of that motherfucker than I can most of the people in the top ten videos. I mean, Oh man, I could show you guys the picture of me over there on the roller coaster. It's really embarrassing. Uh, I was actually crying, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, like, I mean, YouTube, fix your shit. Like, let's be honest. Just, just fix your shit. Push the small content creators. Blah, blah, blah.